welcome back to the Sunday stream. We're gonna try and do this as quickly as possible because I'm tired and I want to make pancakes. I don't really have a good reason, I'm just really tired. And I get to eat the pancakes. All right, for a little context, I am about three we, drinks little... and one Space Jam and New Legacy into brain damage. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh, oh shit. shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. No, it's fine. Shh. It's fine. Shh. Oh sh Yeah, nope, nothing. Well, Meredith seems to found herself in a sticky wicket. How's she gonna get herself out of this one? Should we gather for whiskey and cigars not no. I believe so. Can I drop into the harbor? And you probably could. Probably. No. That'll kill me. Can you climb through the? Okay, cool. <coughs> cool! <laughs> this is Alrighty where I was then. trying to go originally, so I'm glad I didn't completely screw this up. Alright, um... Yeah, okay, so there's them. If only you could do non-lethal takedowns from above. No. Cape whistling. He'll be fine. He's unconscious. Yeah. Oh, I shut that down. Okay. It's probably worth a save. Probably. You okay? Yeah, uh, just, uh, like I said, I'm, like, partially brain damaged by the new Space Jam movie. And also some alcohol. I kind of needed the alcohol in order to get through that movie. Not gonna lie, it was not great. Yeah. Well... I don't know why you expected anything else. Oh, Hero. I was expecting a mildly competent film. That? Why? I don't know, because I thought people actually took, you know, movie making seriously. No. Why would you if that was your script? Uh. There weren't even any script writers. They were story artists. They said so in the credits. I'm, uh, yeah. There was a head story artist and then like 30 other so-called story artists, which probably couldn't call themselves writers because well, they weren't... Well, that's just my pet theory. We don't know anything. True, but I wouldn't be surprised if you were actually right. That <laughs> they couldn't call themselves writers. Because they weren't part of the guild of writers guild or whatever. That was just oof. I'm surprised it wasn't just all Alan Smithy. Alan Smithy. <laughs> I will say that some of the animation was actually really good. Mm -hmm. Keep these rats off me so that I can get out. I don't think it matters if she sees you. Is it the... No, it's not Granny Rags. Uh oh. Look at that. You've got yourself a little rat cloud. What are they doing? I don't think they know. Well, that checks out. Take care of the rats, please. 
You're, um... There you go. I have to eat all the white ones! There, I did it. You did. I did. It was clearly the easiest way. Thank you for helping me. I thought it was... There were rats. So many rats. Completely infested. Mm -hmm. Yes. I know some folks aren't superstitious, but I swear, the rats showed up after a man came through, waving around an amulet of some kind. It looked like it was made of bone. But he's dead now. Just like the others who were living here. So, he can control the rats, you say? No, it just seemed like the rats were preternaturally attracted to his bone charm. Oh. Uh, I can tell you for a fact that rats really are preternaturally attracted to bones. Little weirdos. They do love their bones. Mm-hmm. Vengeance. Vengeance. Yeah. That was, no, it was wisdom. Never mind. I, I was trying to think of that one thing with um, uh, the guy that doesn't have a uh, phantom limb. That's his name from Venture Brothers. Oh yeah. It's this whole bit where like. The he, wisdom was the cup. The wisdom was the cup, and then he had Lady Nightshade, which was one of Dr. Girlfriend's stilettos. Yeah. Yeah, it, it was pretty pathetic. That show is a trip and a half. You can just... You can just walk. Trying. Just go in the door. Yeah, that's a face. Mm-hmm. He was really trying hard to be that raspy team. Mm. The best part about this level is like there's a way to skip ninety percent of it, which makes it sound mean. But you might as but well. But I had a fuck of a time going through this level legitimately, and when I found this on my second playthrough, I was so happy. There he is. Approximately one rune. One bone charm. Shoop. Mm. Hmm. That doesn't look safe to swim in. But, well. No, it is. It's only a few hagfish. Safe enough. A few turds float by. Safe enough. I didn't say it was good. <laughs> Safe as anything in this city, though. Can you slurp through there? There's ways around. Oh. Oh, how? See, this is what we missed last time I was out here. Oh. Uh -huh. And a couple coins, mm -hmm. of course. Not drawing attention to ourselves at all. Mm, no one's around to hear it. If you break a board in the city and no one's around to hear it, did you actually break the board? Well, I'm someone. 
are you though? You're the you're but a whisper upon the wind. Um, I'm a very stabby whisper. This whisper likes to stab things. Mm. No, see, like, there's the front door. Right? Right. And we'll get back to this. There's also, like, an optional little safe down here. Just stab him! Just stab who? I just got here! Oh, God. It still itches. I'm sorry. Just, I think it's all in my head, but it still itches. I mean, it was. It should be gone by now. I oh. Yeah, I know. Like I said, I think it's in my head. Mom's allowed to stab Dad on Mondays. It's their stab day. It's Stabber Day. Oh, they're just—they're still talking. Right, right. I mean. Why worry about a couple of disgusting smelly mm. pigs, you know? All pigs get slaughtered sooner or later. Is that a wall of light there? Oh, you don't have to stop. You don't have to stop texting me. Yeah, it's a wall of light. It, it will shred them if they leave. Oh. All right, and then you go that way, and I stay up here, and nobody has to wake up. With their hands in other people's pants. I was gonna say cookie jar, but okay. If that's what we're calling it now. Hands in other people's cookie jars. You're making this up, babe. I am. So you're making up a whole joke. I'm making up a whole joke while I've got, like, my brain swimming in alcohol, so... Where is... I didn't say it was going to be good. I said it was going to be swimming in alcohol. That's a lot of bodies. Eh. Well, at least you didn't have to think about the uh, password to it. Mm-hmm. Oh, he's gonna Yeah, he was gonna hear that. Oh, it's just the rats, don't worry. Rats are getting belligerent, that's what it is. My god, they've learned basic masonry! Make me find you. I'm not paid enough to try. I'll get to the bottom. Will you? I guess everything's all yeah, right. no, everything's fine, man. I don't know why you're freaking out. You, you, you're stressed. Take a nap or something. I don't know. Jeez. That's it. One, and two, dead. And then I hear someone whistling, but I don't know where the hell they are. There you are. A car. I am the very model of stealth. <coughs> Look at this sadness. This happened yesterday. Oh, I'm sorry, hon. I can't- I'm not, like... Fuck. Why? Every time! There we go! 
<laughs> oh, hey, at least you didn't stab him. Oh, my goodness, he's wearing a little muzzle. Isn't that cute? Okay, who wants freedom? <clears throat> you do. I don't know who you are or why you did this for me, but listen. Nearby, there's a partially collapsed. You mean this? Up on what used to be the third uh -huh. floor, you'll see a painting. I used to work there. Behind the painting, there's a safe, and the code is 294. 294, got it. Well, hello. I don't know why she says, like, near here instead of we're standing in. You know? Oh. That's what it is. Ooh. Yeah. I just like saving them because it's a nice thing to do, but, you know. Fringe benefits. Yeah. I always, whenever somebody said fringe benefits, I always thought they said French benefits. And it always messed with me for a while until I saw it written out. Okay then. Yeah. So you're like, why does anybody care about French benefits? I. Uh, you know. Does it mean you get a baguette? Oh, right, so yep. we're getting back to just skipping most of this frickin' level. Alright, so that's the entrance. There is a place around here where you can see right outside Sokolov's frickin' office. And then if you have everything upgraded, and you get to a good enough vantage point... You just like zap on over. You just zoop. Mm hmm. Sure. And this level's a bitch because you have shit like those enforcers that turn your magic off. Oh. Yeah. So, this is how I like to do it. Believe in you. It's fine. Nobody would have believed you anyway. So yeah. All you gotta do is get Sokolov and get out. And their only rune in the place is right there. So it's like, it's almost an apology. Uh. Because I fought my way through this damn thing. Saw this way, you know, through the whole fucking complex to get up here. And then my second playthrough, I just do this. As for test subject B12, after the characteristic sloughing of the skin, she should be dead by mid morning tomorrow. How are you feeling? Can't you give me something for the pain? I do have many pain remedies, yes. But alas, I cannot give you any. They could interfere with my research. You should thank me. Soon we will have a cure for this terrible disease. Thanks to all my hard work and dedication. Uh. Yes, thank you, sir. Thank you. 
Cool. Target neutralized. Hey, honey. Treat yourself. Thank you. Whoever you are, it kept me in a cage. Oh man, who would ever do that? Pain is horrible right now. So I'll just hide in a corner and leave when I'm feeling better. Yeah, okay. Well, you know, I tried. So do we have to get out of here with him? Yeah. Oh. It's really not gonna be that hard. Alright. So I'm just gonna put this on. They'll think he's still in here. Excellent progress. That's my reason. That's good that's sound reasoning. The circle out sound a little tinnier than usual. No, that's just the walls. Oh, okay. Yeah, so all we gotta do now is, uh... Get up. Shoop. Don't get with me? Yep. Yes, he is still with me. So we shall save again. It'd be really weird if you teleported and didn't take whatever yeah. you were holding. But, you know. Yeah, that level is a mess, and I do not apologize for skipping it. Huh. I, I would feel bad. And anyway, Beth, the next episode, you're gonna really freaking like it. So that's why I want to get through this shit show. The royal physician himself. He made a neat job of it. Dropping here and we'll be off. Sweet. Let's get the hell out of Dodge. So yeah. Oh, that was easy. Oh, I missed a painting. Oh well. Surgical. <laughs> nice. Yeah. I'm pretty proud of that. That is like the dead easiest way to get the whole... Do that whole level. And it's a absolute mess. Well, Not as in poorly designed, just as in I don't want to deal with it. The cell for so long uh. the kennel. Shackles and everything. It'll be a shock him waking up in the straw and old dog poop. From what I hear, he's woken up worse places. As we all have at that. Buddy, what kind of life you've been living? I'm a little concerned about you. I'm a, I'm, I'm like a royal assassin fuck toy. I don't want to, and I've woken up in some weird places. <laughs> but Sam, I don't want to imagine where you found out you went to sleep the night before. Well done, Corporal. Well done. I doubt a dozen soldiers could have done uh -huh. it better. Sokolov's knowledge will enable us to strike at the Lord Regent directly, and ultimately help you get your life back. Soon, we won't have to hide in the shadows. The royal physician is brilliant, but he was a fool to protect the Lord Regent. Sokolov gave us the elixir, the war machine. He could have made us a great nation. Uh -huh. Now he pays the price for siding with a tyrant. You have my thanks, sir. If you wish to get some sleep, now is the time. Alrighty then. Yeah, I'm just speeding this along as quickly as I can. I just kind of wonder how uh, Piero is going to act with Sokolov around, because like, aren't they supposed to be like scientific rivals or something? Uh huh. <sighs> they are. It depends on, um. It depends on how you want to play the game. Hmm. Corvo, wake up! You were making funny faces while you were sleeping. I decided to nap here in your room while Callista was taking a bath. She told me if there's ever trouble, I should always run here. I mean, she's right. Callista will come get me when she's done with her bath. Thanks, Corvo. It makes me feel better. Oh, I love you, kid. And you gave daddy sleep darts! Oh, you're the best! She can sleep in my room anytime she wants. 
This is a drawing I made of you without your scary mask. Aww. Yeah. It says daddy at the top, too. Aww. Yeah, I'm just saying it's, you know. They weren't hiding it. <laughs> What you reading about? It's a lot of words. Holy shit. Alright. <laughs> Corvo is not a wordsman. The Takes after her mom, thank god. <laughs> Royal physician. I believe you and Corvo knew each other in former days. Unlike you, our friend Corvo knows what loyalty is. <laughs> I am loyal to my inner spirit. You are the one consorting with the most wanted man in the Empire. I think that might actually do something my really bad if I hold it down. <laughs> okay. And the former spy master, or the Lord Regent, as he calls himself, is a ruthless tyrant bent on destroying this city, the heart of the Empire. You are mistaken if you uh, so you so this is a um this place is called the hound pit and uh there's a hound in there probably no but i'm just saying it's for dog fighting ah uh, it's kind of neat that they just put that there they also will do one hound versus rats now uh, and I don't know how I know that. I just know I do. Is that the company you keep? Uh, anyway, they're talking about the plot. The company this is why we have subtitles up. So we know you painted a portrait of the Lord Regent's mistress. The very aristocrat with So the Lord Regent is fucking a rich lady. Rich lady is one of three possible sisters. The sisters are all holding a masquerade tonight. Ha ha. This rabble, but I know you have your reasons. Fair enough. Yes, he does. All we need is the name of the Lord Regent's mistress. It's very simple. I elect not to tell you. You will have to force the words from me, and I warn you, my willpower is quite legendary. Sure it is, buddy. Curious strategy. Of which I approve. We're gonna bribe him. So we're gonna go talk to Piero, because no one's gonna know what he likes more. And it is his rival, after all, so... Mm -hmm. This is the nice way to do it. You can also feed him to rats until he talks. Oh yeah, here's Piero spying on Callista taking a bath, because he's a fucking creepazoid. Looks, I was inventing a new kind of lock. The tumblers... Shaped like snowflake. The truth is, there is no snowflake lock. I was just, you know, looking. The truth is, there is no snowflake lock. I was just looking no. through the lock. But now I want a snowflake lock. There's no option for, I don't need your sleep darts that bad, you fucking goon. So we're just going to go with the top one. I couldn't bear it if she knew. I know you're a man of honor, and I also- uh -huh. Walls are super Kill me thin. at any time. Perfect. Let's underline that part. Apologize and beg for your discretion. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah, cool. Hey, Callista, bathe elsewhere! Jackass. Yeah, no, waddle wait. It's well known that Sokolov is virtually addicted to a rare liquor called King Street Brandy. The taste is revolting. You look like the Grinch, but shaven and However, bleached. I'm reluctant to give it to you for Sokolov. It, <laughs> Except it did not the help smile. the situation. It's very expensive stuff, a blend of rare Pendicium spices and a drop of whale oil. Would you care to purchase it? Yeah, you fucking goon. Boot stealth. Mm 
boot stealth. Boot stealth. You can't stab him. But... But he doesn't know that. <laughs> but have you tried? Yeah, if you stab them or even knock any of them out, they start bit... They just throw you out. And then it's game... It's like an automatic game over. Oh. Yeah, it's really fucking disappointing. I would love to be able to just knock them out with no consequences. I could use it. King Street Brandy. I didn't know any more existed. It's an extraordinary gift. I see I'm dealing with men of taste. Just these are diamond shaped bulbs out of here. <laughs> she was always referred to as Lady Boyle. I think it's not just some flats you can put in your coat pocket. <laughs> You see, I painted her from behind. I assure you, she still makes a striking portrait. But I do not know which Boyle she is. I was to be introduced to her at a masked ball in her honor this very night. But I will miss that party. We're going to a masquerade! This is my favorite level. This is one of the levels we have one of the best memories of. Boyles are wealthy and that's good. No, you were there. Of course, I'm, you already have a mask. My brain's not on full power right now. Yep. He's right. You will be able to mingle with them once you're on the ground. You'll have to Jesus. find out which of the boy or women is connected to the Lord Regent and take her out in whatever way you can find. You're very close now. If you do this tonight, you'll be able to strike at the Lord Regent himself and put Emily on the throne. May the wind favor you. Cool. Cool. All right. Well, anyway. Ah, come on. I hear you're off to the boils little bash tonight. Yeah, you're drinking a I lot the there, bud. I'd like to ask you. Could you give this note to Lord Shaw? So anyway, after his brothers have gone missing, him. a rather brusque man yeah. wearing a wolf's You might notice him drinking more and slurring more. It's kind of a nice touch. Huh. Yeah. Yeah, but his brothers deserved it, though. Yeah, but he still has raging guilt, and apparently he might not be a legitimate Pendleton child. Oh. The drama in this game is it's delicious. See, the Boyle costume ball, huh? Well, that'll be fun, but not for everybody. Fuck ready? yeah, I'm ready. I got all my goodies. Let's go! This is gonna be the best fucking Halloween ever. I think I remember the last time you played this, like, you had to knock a whole bunch of people out That's, and you put yeah. them all in the bedroom. And then it turned out to be the wrong bedroom to put them in. That's the memory I was talking about. Yeah. Because I had to, like, pause time and then sprint up the stairs and throw the body into the hallway before she got up and got alerted to me. That was beautiful. Uh, I remember that now. I just kind of remember, I just kind of turned around and just said, Is it hot in here? Still watching? <laughs> the Lord Regent's pulling out all the stops for the Boyle family. I didn't think there'd be tall boys patrolling here tonight. Watch yourself, Corvo. They don't fool around. See, the good news is, once you get to the party, that mask of yours let you blend right Tall in. boys are armored people boys. on stilts. You there is no, no pacifistic way to disable them. Oh. You can only avoid them. And they, they like fire grenades at you. They're armored, so you can only hit them from certain angles with explosive bolts. Fucking gnarly. Hmm. Yeah. Okay. Where are we going? Oh.
Now, for some reason, I'm just kind of imagining Michael Phelps with the using short powers. Short. Oh, how this is related? The blink. Like, if we lived in a world where, like, people actually had mutant powers, would there be, like, an Olympics for mutants? Uh, probably. I mean... I'm sorry, there was something that came up really quick. Alright, uh, we'll no, be... No, 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 don't, don't, oh, don't, no, it's fine. Okay, I was... I didn't no know how long it was gonna be. Hmm. Uh, there's no point in pausing it. Like, I'm already done. Okay. I didn't know. Alright. I should save because I got. Uh, da -da 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 -da. charm over there and a rune so I can't just pass it up. Let's not piss the tall boy off, Freddy, please. Oh, heck yeah. Uh, home to the most powerful families in Dunwall, the estate district has been the jewel of the city's crown for generations. That's where we are right now. No district enjoys finer restaurants or cultural events, and no families inspire more admiration. <laughs> you can read that on your own time. King Sparrow Feathers. Oh man, spoil me rotten. Okay, so they're over there. How do even? You're in here? Those are weepers! Those are weepers! They're just having a conversation? No, they're just... They're just weepers. I thought they were just like kind of having a chat. No, they weren't talking. They don't. They don't talk. Well, maybe in a language that you don't understand. Maybe they... once you become a plague zombie, you just kind of like come up with your own thing. I mean, I don't know. These are like the remains of very well-to-do families. That just like hold themselves in here rather than admit they are sick or hmm. poor. Oh, it's a shrine. Hey, good looking. Party, Corvo. That's the plan. Is that what you dreamed of? All those months in Coldridge Prison while waiting for the executioner? Well, beautiful women in the latest. Well, the beautiful women part yeah, is accurate. And what of the host, Lady? Whatever. I can see all her tomorrows, and I know that either she dies tonight at your hand, or she'll live out her days, month after month, year after year, far away, even as her fine clothes wear into tatters, and her silken hair gets dull and gray. Half the city can see the lights from the party, and they dream of the delights inside. Will you tear it all to pieces? Either way, it's Lady Boyle's last party. Okay. Uh, th th thanks, Outsider. Lady Boyle's last party. Make it a good one. You asked me to decide, you asked me to do it. There's a hole in the world. 
What? Uh oh. I think that's a bit dreary. What? Oh. You're working it out then? Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. <sighs> okay, well, pick a time. Go into a party. Uh, oh, shit. That's fine, actually. That probably was better than an alternative. He's just pissed. I think it'll be okay. So, do you need the key to get in there, or? Or out, yeah. I don't know why we can't. It's like. What is that heartbeat? Like, it. Alright, you get off this. Oh. sake. No, yeah, no. Why would I want to be able to, like, fucking fight off a goddamn fish? It's fine! Kill me! I don't even care anymore! <sighs> There's a world outside this sewer, right? Well, theoretically. <laughs> well, they somebody thinks you're out there. I'll write to her again. She has to see reason. Oh shit. Can't knock him out. There you go. Go up. Stop, I see you. Well, do you? I'm gonna see what's down here. How about that? Bunch of weepers. They move? No. Sort of. They're shambling. <sighs> Can't open this door. This is just not going as the way I remember it going. I don't even remember the way it went to begin with. But hey, you got another bone charm. Yeah. How the hell do I get out of here? There's a door? Okay then. Yeah, it'll be fine. I don't think weepers can open doors. There you go. Try to blend in. Okay, cool. That's not, I don't, you know, 
that's not the coolest way to do it, but that's the only way I remember how to do it anymore. Yeah. Hi. Okay, then. We're all cool. We're all cool. We're all cool. Yeah. Let's go into the Boyle Mansion. <laughs> Weren't you supposed to do something with him, or? Not yet. He's optional. Okay. Here we are. Mm -hmm. That's uh, quite the punch bowl. I want fish. Before the Empress died, and the plague do. Are you sure? That's not how I was. Did something cause? Just eat everything. <laughs> what are they gonna do? Stop me? Om nom nom nom. I say nothing against the Lord. That's what a whale looks like. Ah. Will make us great again. Some of us will be great. Ah! Hello. Now, now, it's just luck they found. That's one lady boil. And that we can't make the rat lights without them. And we can't get rid of the rats. Rat lights and whale. I believe so. That's all we live for now. We found out what the whales could do, and it made us an empire. This is the beginning of a golden age. Do you know they've dug down and found the ruins of another city under this one? Before the overseers, before anything. I bet they thought they were in a golden age. You need another drink, friend. I think we all need a drink. Would you want to join us for hunting next year in the month of Lynn? Get wherever you're going. Hello. Careful, sir. You look like the day. Oh, incredibly. Hello, Jello. Hello. Jesus, the rabbits are big here. That is quite the rabbit. You can't go in there, or... Come on. Talk. Welcome to my party. I don't believe I've had the pleasure. There's one lady boil. There's another lady boil. I trust you are on the guest Oh, yeah, definitely somewhere. The whale, just, the whale just spouts confetti sometimes. Confetti! It's something I would see. Something I would definitely have. There's a third lady boil. Here's a mystery. Are you perhaps with the Campbells? A sure! I'm definitely with somebody. Ricardus claims he memorized the litany on the white cliff in a night. Miss Adelaide White, Miss Brian, uh, Ella Triss. Is it possible? No. Corvo Corvo Atano. <laughs> Wouldn't you like to know? Ugh, you smell like the streets. Been yeah, been sleeping you? with your mom. Ooh. Did you hear about Mrs. Grimsley? You'll never believe this. What is it now? I'm gonna get pissed drunk. Because if I have to deal with the aristocracy, that's what's gonna happen. No family left. I thought her interests were... The aristocrats. I think she ran out of What's it all about? And how Is that pool know? with like so extra bumpers? Some, yeah. Rights, I can only sexual rights, huh? I heard she bathed in her own nephew's blood. Ridiculous. What sort of hygiene? What sort of hygiene it's is a that? For the outside to keep them safe. Emma, you could get her sent to the abbey. Nobody that rich gets sent anywhere they don't want. The Brimsleys made an awful lot of money this past century. Makes you wonder if those rituals work. What happened to the boy? I hear he enjoyed himself very much for a while. Mm-hmm. I want a whale centerpiece that just blows confetti every now and again. <laughs> you, a 
This guy's dressed as a whale, and there's a moth. situation, as I think I proved it. I told you not to bring that up. There's a great deal I could offer you. Don't be silly. The rumors say the Boyles practically own your estate. What if I said I could get you out of the city, away from all this, to Sir Kronos or further? I don't believe you, sir. But if you're telling the truth, we should talk further, but not here. Excuse me. Oh, leave him be. It's a party. This is a private conversation. Is it? It's a party. It's called mingling. Mingle all you want, then. We'll speak later. I'll find you. Good evening. Mm-hmm. Hello again. Lydia, Waverly, Esma, White, Black, Red. There has to be a clue upstairs. So we have to figure out which boil is which and which one was fucking the Lord Regis. I was thinking of sneaking mm -hmm. upstairs to look for clues. And it changes, so it's not like I can just Ah, oh, that's, that's interesting. Welcome to the Boyle estate. Also, there's an arc pylon preventing us from going on upstairs. And I mm. can't teleport in front of everybody. So we're gonna see what we can see. It's taking out your sword in the middle of a freaking party. They just right. think it's a prop. As long as you don't attack anybody, you should be okay. You should see uh, this as an opportunity. To what? Learn a trade, join the city watch. Your house built its fortune in crisis. I know your mission tonight. We must speak privately. Oh. Okay. I always forget it's him. I mean, what is that? It's a Lord Brisby, apparently. Yeah, with that mask. I'm a friend of Pendleton's, and I've done a few favors for your cause. I know your purpose here tonight. And, how to say this, your target is the woman I love. I swear that if you'll bring her to me unharmed, we will never hear of her again. There's a cellar directly below the kitchen. I'll wait for you there. I'm not proud of this, but surely it's better than seeing her killed. Her name yeah, sure, I'll, I'll sell her to you. I swear. Uh huh. I'm a man sure. of Sure. Just bring her to the cellar, and I will keep her safe with me. Okay, right. so it's Ezra. Now we just have to figure out which one Ezra is. Esme? Esme, Ezra, I don't know. It's just. Can't get over your mask. Enjoying yourself? Little. <laughs> Boom. Confetti whale. Oh, hello, I'm Ella. Enjoy the party. It's doing all right there. Step back, sir. I don't believe we're. Dude, acquainted. get away from my jello. You're harshing my jello vibe. Hello. No guests past this cool. point. Cool. Can I go downstairs? Is that cool? That's cool. All right. It's a blood stain. Don't worry about that. Ooh, sweet. Quaff, quaff, quaff. There's another giant fish. It's I wonder like if it tastes like salmon. Shark of some kind. I wonder if it tastes like salmon. Potential. Am I allowed to be here? You don't care. Put that away and leave, or I'll have you. Yes, I. Okay, chill, my dude. I'm trying to turn my dark. I'm warning you to get back. <laughs> Thinking about it. Mm. Rat. Damn you. All right, there's the cellar. Switch needed. Switch. I think you can get that after you uh, take somebody down here. Ooh, 
scary mask. Sorry. Some whale oil. Take out the kitchen staff. <laughs> Nothing personal, sweetie. It's fine. Oh, well, you're probably gonna have to put them somewhere. No. Honestly, if I just carried him, I would have been. I would have done fine. I guess no one's going to go down to the kitchen then. They usually don't. Uh. If they do, when it gets too bad, we'll just reload. Oh yeah, this is where all the good shit is. Look at this bedroom. This is where the magic happens. I am going to be dumping corpses here, yes. That's where the magic happens. Esma, darling, you were right to this, Esma. There are three costumes for your party. It pains me that I can't be there, though I'm sure you understand why. I know you're going to look lovely in black. That's not so much a clue as it is just the answer to this puzzle. Ah. Uh. I've enclosed the skeleton key to Dunwall Tower. Okay, well. I think I got a skeleton key to Dunwall Tower now. And a pearl. Well then, alright, so. We're looking for the lady in black. Mm hmm. Good night, Gracie. Now I'll be fine. Good enough. Ooh, another painting. Yeah, glad I kept that on. are there? Mm, enough to guard an entire party? Just the upstairs, though. He's just standing there? Menacingly. Oh, I'm gonna move him. I don't want to be seen, like, by somebody coming around the corner. Yeah, perfect. There's a window seat. Don't think he's just sleeping. Uh-oh. It's fine. Yeah, I'm not gonna be winning any points for stealth. <sighs> I think that's it, though. Alright, so we've gotta find the lady in black, take her down to the basement, and, uh, and that's it? Um, yeah, pretty much. Okay.
She's March now. Oh. That was nice of them. Indeed. See if I can find that guy so we can do the optional fight. And then she has the audacity to take the optional fight. That prize. Yeah. If I could get upstairs, one of them must have left traces. The guy in the garden. Oh. I don't think Corvo knows how to play the piano. Do, do, do you know how to play this piano? Looks more like an organ. Yeah, and there's like another superfluous off to the side one up there. Extra keys. You remember who's who, don't you? Where is the moth headed chick? There you are. Although at this stage, I don't know who we could beat. But don't you see. <laughs> I beg your pardon. Don't bother me. I'm watching the halls. You saw him too? Friendship is an unfortunate lapse of taste. Oh, hello, handsome. Oh, really? Who am I then? In the flesh. Now, do you know what my sisters are wearing? I'm guessing Waverly's in white. She's wearing white tonight. <laughs> oh my word, I wasn't supposed to say, was I? Lydia and Waverly will be so furious. This is exactly what they said would happen. I'm sorry I've gotten you in trouble. Perhaps you could give me a tour of the upstairs? That sounds lovely. Why don't you come with me? Yeah, cool, let's, let's go do that. Let's go take a tour of the upstairs. A nice long tour then you have to find a way to get her downstairs yeah I already cleared that oh. what a handsome group of guards we have I hope this plague lasts forever sure Oh, my best friends are here. Will you be Isn't near the it city during the puke feast this year? Yes, yes. I'm so glad she's going to have a great last night. You know, I have a dirty little secret. You can't imagine who I'm seeing. I mean, if people only knew. But... I'm only doing it to ensure the family name. It's too dangerous right now not to have proper connections. Okay, can we just... Truthfully, if I could get free of him, I would. You're more my type. Mysterious, silent, self-composed. I do believe this is going to be a fabulous evening. Yeah, okay. <laughs> fabulous evening. Fabulous. Just amazing. So, if you had let that continue, what would have happened? Hmm. Usually they just stand and stare at you for a while. Huh. Can't imagine it would have gone well. Thanks. Could the city get any worse? Yes, of course. You're fine. Yeah, they're all they're, they're all good. They're all having naps. I 
I see. Where is she? You found her. Quickly, let's get her on board. At last. Oh, my love. Someday you will understand. You'll never know how happy you've made me. Someday she'll learn. I don't. What? After all, she'll have her whole life. I Assassinated. What? Assassinated. That's supposed to be the non-violent option. Huh. What? Schrodinger's target. I think she must have died? When you jumped? Yeah. Or something? And it just registered it as dead? Even though she's... You want to reload and try that again? Maybe? I think it's kind of funnier this way. <laughs> okay. I mean, it, it's... The game thinks she's alive. And dead. Oh. Schrodinger's target. Hmm. Alright, well. Got uh, Esma out the way. Do we have to do the others, or? No, we can. Please help me! Okay. Now you won't get blamed. <laughs> I helped. Uh, okay. I think I fucked this mission up pretty royally. We were such good friends. Who the fuck are you? Where is that dude? You know what? I think you're supposed to get the mission somehow. I think it's from like Whalehead. Talk. So mysterious. Okay, fine. You seem interesting. I love that mark on the back of your hand. I swear she's supposed to do something. Mm hmm. I don't know why only three of them have like whale heads or like animal heads. It really makes them stand out. Hey, whale. Who invited you? You don't look familiar. Cool. I'm gonna go kill that guy in the garden now. Just fuck it. You know, just fuck it. Please move along. Kill everybody else tonight. Why is Lord Shaw still here? Isn't that the guy that you're supposed to kill? No, that was the guy that was there that, that, that like took her. Oh. That was Brisby. Yeah, it was the other guy, yeah. I don't know anymore, man. I'm very confused. <sighs> I fucked this mission up like the worst I've ever done it. <laughs> but you're doing it. And you're doing it well. Look at the floating lights! Isn't that so cool? Hmm. You couldn't stand the party either. Not really. Oh, this is a note. Right, this is a note from Lord Trevor Pendleton. This is great. This is great. I really hate Pendleton. Pendleton? Hmm. What's he got to say to me? Pendleton is a gutless, lying sack of shit. I hope he's paying you well for this. Okay. Pendleton just signed us up for a duel, and we're being his uh, second. Hurry up and let's see what. Ah. Uh. Yeah. I fucking hate Pendleton. He is a gutless, lying sack of shit. No, he's not paying me well for this. A contest of honor will take place between this anonymous gentleman acting for the challenger, Lord Trevor Pendleton, and Lord Shaw, the challenged party. 
You will each turn and proceed to the marked positions and remain facing away from each other as I count down from three. You may then turn and fire Get at Get on with it. I'll kill this fool and we can all go back inside. Sorry, my lord. You shall proceed. You're gonna do it with sleep dart? Mm-hmm. Right there. Would bend time be like the thing you would want? Two. One. And that's another patron dead. What do we do now? You use a sleep tart. Yeah. Command. I hear the Estermonts pay top coin. They don't know what dead is. <laughs> they do not. Let's see if we can find a little brandy. Let the boils clean up the mess. <laughs> Just shove them in the shrubbery. <laughs> They'll be fine. You two are going to get really, really, really <coughs> drunk. And then you're going to have a very nasty wake-up call when your boss wakes up in the bushes. <laughs> So, back to the boat? Yeah, I mean, like, we could get the rune. How much do you really care? I mean, I could do bend time. Fucking eight runes, though. The counselor is dead. Yeah, I don't know why. I'm kind of curious to see how the game's gonna, you know, what what ending screen it's gonna give me for this. Could just fucking gun it. You could. I don't really have the energy to try this again, but we might try this again next week. Okay. Samuel has moved! Samuel, how could you? Ah, for fuck's sake. They tried. I hope you enjoyed your evening, sir. But we'd best be on our way. Quickly. <laughs> well, the evening was certainly enjoyable. We certainly had an evening. <laughs> Twas an evening. Didn't kill anyone. No, you definitely uh, failed. It says you failed that. But is it gonna count as alive or dead? I didn't, or is he just gonna send me a very angry letter I didn't see for the receiving chaos. damaged goods? I didn't see what the chaos level was. I'm gonna have to redo that level. There's just no two ways about it. But I'm not doing it this week. Maybe yeah, just do like an impromptu lazy stream. Okay. I checked the wine cellar. Losing family gives a man a thirst. Yeah, Lord Pendleton's a little bitch, and he's gonna get a lot. He's gonna need wine when I'm done with him. Just wanna see. I trust you enjoy. Attention, Dunwall citizens. The You're lucky I can't punch you. You did it. And now we've done away with a woman and a noble woman at that. But Boyle was uh -huh. She helped the Lord Regent kill the Empress. So I don't feel a thing for her. Personally, I heard you upheld my name in a rather spectacular style and at some risk to yourself. I want to thank you for it. 
This little item has been helpful to my family over the generations. But I think you'll find more use for it than I ever will. Go on. Take it. You've had a long night, Corvo. But I fear it's not over. Havelock and Martin have already cooked up something more for you. They would like to see you now. In Havelock's chambers above the bar. So did I kill her or not? Attention, Dunwall citizens. I think the game counts it as a kill. Corvo, the time has come. Everything we have done, everything that you have done. Okay, just the hell of it. Uh, thanks for tuning in. I think we're done now. <laughs> Alright. We'll see you next time. And all that stuff. Bye-bye. <laughs>